dude. Do you think that water's gonna be too shallow? Damn, dude, look at that. <coughs> oh, snap. Oh, need my chair. Oh, get out. Alright guys, I feel like I always say alright guys when I start this, but anyway, we've been here before, you've seen it in one of the videos. Um, the water's a lot, a lot, a lot cooler than it was last time we were here, so we thought we'd give this place another shot. We know there's big ones in here, and that's pretty much the goal for the day. Yeah, we're underneath the highway. Pretty much the goal for the day is just to catch the biggest fish we can find. And uh, I hope we can uh, capitalize on that, and let's, let's just see if we can do it. Did you see that? Yeah. That fish I just scared? Yeah. A minute ago, man, I had one hit the swim bait right next to the kayak. I can't hear you. When we first got in, I had one hit the swim bait right next to the kayak. You did? It was like out in deep water. Did you lose it or did it miss? He just missed it. Like it's like he seen me. I just scared that fish. I saw him swim off. Yes. I'm going to work my way up to this tree right here and start going that way. Start fishing this. Yeah, it's kind of weird, man, the way that fish hit a swim bait. It's like he didn't want it. It's almost like he just kind of bumped it. It's almost like he's just getting it because of the reaction. Yeah. All right, so what I'm about to do is I'm about to go underneath this bridge right here and start throwing this swim bait around all these little pillars right here. I don't know what you call those. I'm just going to call them a pillar. Hopefully, there's a bass stacked up over there somewhere hiding. And maybe he's a big one. I had a fish, but I'm hung. one place I'm about to try before we leave and that's all the way at the end. Every time I go all the way to the end, way down there, and I cast by those trees in the water, I feel some there's always a fish over there. I'm gonna run over there real quick so we waste a lot of time.
got a fish. Finally. This fish is pulling me everywhere. Oh my god, it's a massive fish. Chase! Oh. Please don't break off. Oh my lord. There we go. Look at that fish. That's a good fish, probably a good solid four. Hold on, I'm about to call my buddy real quick. Alright, so I got like a four or five pound bass on. I don't really know how much it weighs. The reason why I'm going to go take it to show Chase is because we've been here for about an hour and a half and neither one of us has caught a single fish. And I happen to hook onto like a four or five pound bass and I'm like, I want to go rub it in his face, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to take it over there. I got him on my little leash. I'm going to take him for a walk, take my fish on a walk, and then uh, I'll pull him back out and show you again. All right, sound good? Probably about four or five. I ain't gonna leave. Where'd you get him at? Back there. In that corner? No, it was over there. You know how like right when you pass that little part where it gets really thin to go to the other side? Yeah. Right there to the right, there's some branches poking inside the water and I was casting by it. Worm? Yeah. I missed one over here and then I got that little fucking game. I've had a lot of things just kind of swipe at my... Just come um, bump it and run away? Yeah. That's what's happening to me. Probably about four pounds. I'm not gonna wait because I don't really feel like it, but it's a good fish. I'm gonna go ahead and let it go. What he meant to say, y'all, is he's not gonna wait because he knows it's like a three and a half. I don't know what's been going on with me lately, but my fishing game has been off like so bad that I don't even know. Like, it's. I don't know the words to say, honestly, because it's really, it's really, really annoying, but at the same time, I'm not that guy to sit there and complain, but you know what, sometimes it sounds like I do, but I'm really not. It's just kind of like venting almost. It's just, I really want to just have a really good day of fishing and it's just been, it feels like it's been forever since I've had a really good day. But uh, I caught that little four or five, it wasn't too bad. Wish I would have caught a bigger one. I would, honestly, I would have rather it had numbers that day. Uh, I kicked the dustpan on the ground, but I wish I would have just had a little bit of numbers today, not just, I don't know, it's hard to explain, but anyway, after that, we left that pond, and we went to another spot that my buddy knows about, and we snuck back behind this little dam area, and you can kind of stand on the ground, or you can stand up on this little, um, it's, I don't really know what it's called, you'll see it in the video, but I'm going to roll over to that clip in just a second, where my buddy caught a good fish, and he couldn't reel it in because of where he was at, so I tossed my line over his line and reeled in his fish and it was almost like we caught the fish together at the same time it was actually pretty badass teamwork you know so uh, i'm gonna roll over to that clip real quick let's check it out huh bring it down here dude hold on it over to me let line out I'll bring him to me I did that on purpose hold on I'm still getting him I got your line Oh, dude! <laughs> 
<laughs> Dude! I can't even count that as a catch for me, though. It was like a team effort catch, right? I did that on purpose. I was like, I'm going to pull it into me. You caught your first chatterbait fish, too. Dude, I seen him, like... I was jigging it along the edge, and out here towards the middle, dude, I just seen a white flash. Wait, way over there? Dude, I want to get a weight on that guy, kind of. You wouldn't be able to get it without f***ing my dad's drowning. I'm dying. I can't get the f***ing hook out of his mouth. That sucker is like super skinny. That's a long ass fish. Sucker If that f was pregnant, man. How much you think, dude? I don't you know. You got a good picture of this for me? Yeah. Well, I don't know why it's so skinny. Do I need to stand back? You're good. Yeah. Dude, that picture does not do this fish justice. No, it doesn't. What you think, about a five? Dude, and my line came off without even having to untangle. Let me get him back in the water real quick. Without even having oh, to... Oh, you stepping on the chatterbait? Without even having to untangle it, my line's off. Dude, what did I tell you? That's a story for the ages right there. Look at that. Team effort. We did that. He hooked it. I caught it. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, man. Told you. Caught a good fish. And uh, I don't know. That one looked like it weighed more than the one that I caught that day. But really, we were just kind of looking for the numbers that day. We didn't really care to just catch one good size fish because that one wasn't even the best fish you could have possibly caught i would have rather caught a really 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 good one but we didn't so i don't know i hope you enjoyed this episode if you like my channel please subscribe show some love and uh fish until you die